here it is, the other battle of the Final Four. Jude Gentleman, can you believe it, doing battle against D-Mac. Well, the first Final Four in his career for June Meng. The guy is stoked, but man, going up against Darren McNamara, this is going to be a challenge. That car is extremely good, Jared. Man, this is uh, unbelievable right now. D Mac, you know what? He's not going to hold anything back, no matter who he's going to battle against. Darren McNamara out front, but already kind of oh. down on the speed, and June Meng overshooting that first clipping point. Yeah, a, a huge gap here, Grand Canyon gap here. Darren McNamara, nice, wide, high line up in that horseshoe oh. right there. And June Mang making some critical errors on the inside. Just too much pressure for June Mang. Look at D-Mac, just locked and loaded right now, creating a huge plume of smoke. June Mang, huge correction there up in the horseshoe. So you got to imagine the pressure getting to June Mang, making some critical errors in the, inside the horseshoe, coming in too tight. Meanwhile, Darren McNamara, perfect on that clipping point. And look at all that smoke. I know June Mang feels blessed right now to be in the final four. He'll take what he can get. You can almost see a smile through his helmet right now. June Mang's going to lead. D Mac's going to give chase. Darren McNamara not on that podium yet. He's got to be careful right here. If June Mang is indeed the slower car, which it seems like he is, he's got to stay oh, back. Oh, 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 oh. Getting gangster there, 86 miles an hour, but just a little too aggressive. D Mac clearly had to avoid hitting June Wow. Mang. You know what's crazy about that, though, is June Mang came in super fast, 86 miles per hour, that's 10 miles per hour faster than Darren McNamara. And as you can see, he just was not able to hang at that speed. And Darren McNamara is going to get the clear victory here. D-Mac is moving on.